that's nice, but that's not the coolest one. Come on, y'all. It's beautiful, but it's not the coolest one. I was looking for like the coolest, most cold-blooded bass line. You know what cold-blooded means? It means nasty, <laughs> ugly, dirty, funky, which means, which means very good. <laughs> okay, when I was 12 years old, when I started playing the bass, this is one of the first songs I ever learned, and it's still one of my favorites. It's a bass line that goes like this. <laughs> Wait, all I gotta do is play two notes? That's a sign of a good bass line, hold on. <laughs> you remember that one? It's called Papa Was a Rolling Stone. Mino Sinalu, Alex Bailey. Huh. Okay, Adam's gonna add some funky Detroit wah-wah guitar. Brett's gonna add some piano, come on, Brett. with some jazz horns. Check this out, y'all.
was a rolling stone. Thank you. One more time for Marquise on the trumpet. Come on, y'all. Give it up, Marquise Hill. Well, I was telling you that we did some collaborating on this album, the Aphrodisia album. It, it features these fantastic musicians. And also, I decided to follow the voyage of my ancestors by jamming with musicians who come from different stops along their voyage. So, um, we jammed with some musicians from West Africa, like I mentioned, from North Africa. Also, we played with some musicians from Brazil, uh, from the Caribbean, the island of Trinidad. And then finally, we made it home to the US. We played with some musicians in the South, like Louisiana. And then we played with some musicians from the big cities, of course, like New York, Chicago, and Detroit. And when I think about Detroit, what do y'all know about Detroit? <laughs> When I think about Detroit, I think about Motown. You guys know Motown? Okay, so I was thinking I would like to do a Motown song on this album. And I'm trying to figure out which one to do. 
And I'm trying to think, which is the Motown song with the coolest bass line? Right, so first I was thinking, 